You get a chance like this, they don't come very often. You better put it away, and he does beautifully. Two, sweet. The Canucks have been throwing lots of pucks on net, and they now lead by two as a result. Still more than half the game left, but they've been the better team, and they deserve this lead. Oh, he laid a solid hit on him there. He was waiting for him and laid the shoulder right into him. That might loosen a few of the choppers on that play. Quick feed to Fiala. San Jose's got into the offensive zone. To his teammate. Taken along the wall by LaFontaine. Puck knocked loose after that hit. Moves it to Radulov. Here's an odd man rush. Can't connect. Quick pass to Fiala. Nice zone entry from the middle. San Jose's got the puck against the half wall. And that's blocked away. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Makes his presence known on the ice. San Jose's ready to go on the attack. They've got numbers. It's a two on one. Turns it away. But he came out and challenged a good save. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Huge steal at his own end. Takes the feed. And they can't convert to the play. What a, he might have a step here. Drives to the paint. Scores! Wow, what a goal! Nice hands, great finish. Little short break and it's in the net. Because he's carrying the puck in a shooting spot, the goalie still has to guard against whether he's gonna deke or not. He freezes him and beats him with the shot. San Jose's got one back late in the second. How does that change things now, Ray? From their bench, it seems like they're pretty excited. They jumped up, they're loud, they're ready to go as they try to find the equalizer. Here's the pass, and that's picked off in front. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Great save by the goaltender. Just real smart positioning on that one. Yeah, it's in a dangerous spot. He makes a good save here. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. There's the whistle penalty coming up. So often in a, in a shifty little play, the, you're trying to get to the puck, you get your stick in the wrong spot, he steps on your stick and there's nothing you can do. Gets it out of his own end. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Sends it over. Easily turned aside. He scores! Talk about capitalizing there. They looked like they were more aggressive knowing that they were going to get a power play. You can take a chance. There's no risk of giving up anything against. San Jose's even things up here in the late stages of this second period. Working to get this game back to square has not been an easy road, but now it's a short game as we enter the last little bit of the second period. Made the stop on the play. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Save made by the goalie. And a poke check knocks the puck away. The Canucks have possession shorthanded. Grabbed along the boards by Eichel. Sends it across, and that's broken up. Tatars carrying it ahead. Here's a short pass to Bjorkstrand. Wow. Puts it into the back of the net for the goal. Yeah, breaks this tie, James. You know when these teams get locked up tight, sometimes it stays that way a long time. The goalie doesn't get a clean look at this with the traffic in front of the net. He's trying to find the puck, and by the time he does, it's behind him. San Jose's timing couldn't be better here late in this second to go ahead by one. The break's not that far away, and they want to make sure they go into it with the same lead they have now. The Canucks gain possession along the wall. Quick feed to McDavid. Unable to reach that one. They were on their heels, forcing an icing, and they're not going to get much of a break on this either. No, you get tired, you make a bad pass, or you just panic and clear it down the ice. Now you got to try and win a draw and get it safely out of the zone so you can change. Scooped up along the wall by McDavid. Shoot, shoot. Centered out in front, and he somehow, he scores! 
A finish late in the period seems to carry over into the next period more often than not. What a great time to score. A quick flick of the wrist, and that snapshot beats the goaltender. He's in the low slot. He doesn't have much time to think about it. The Canucks have answered back in a big way here late in the second. They really push themselves back into this game, trailing by one. They work their way back to a tie game. That'll do it for period number two. Boy, if you like offense, this is a game made for you. It's about to go down, period number three. James Savalski, Ray Ferraro, ready to bring you the action. And we are underway here in the third, still tied. Excellent stick work on the play. Ovechkin's taken down to the ice. We got a penalty coming up. Strong defensive effort. Time for the official to pass down his sentence. Latang's off to the box. Two minutes for tripping. Once he puts up his little token argument here, he's going to circle around a bit and try and regroup here as he goes to the penalty box. Were you box. a haggler? Always. You never think it's the right call. And that's turned aside by Joseph. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Good defensive effort to poke it away. The Canucks have it from their own end. Beery's lugging the puck. Takes the feed from his own end. One pass and out. Good play. Tries to get it over to Tatar. Couldn't complete the play. And he regains control of the puck. Loses his balance on the play. Moves it quickly over to Tatar. We got a delayed penalty coming up. That trip right in front of the official's eyes. Can't get away with that. Let's see the call here. The Canucks are being called for tripping. It's a tough penalty to take. You're trying to do the right thing. Unfortunately, you pull his feet out. You got to go to the penalty box. San Jose's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Denies him with a save. Four on four play usually starts pretty cautiously. It takes one missed pass or one all alone. Oh, what a stop. Oh, goaltender looks so sure as he made that stop on the breakaway. Great reflexes, another save. Oh, he's locked right in. A couple of stops in a row there. Wierenski's moving the puck through his own zone. Henrique's having one of those nights again. He's got multiple points, and you know that he wants more. Couldn't find the intended target. Play whistle dead because of an offside. We're still in the early stages of this period. We are all tied up in this one. Swoops in off the wing to grab the puck after the centerman tied him up. Sends it in on the attack. San Jose's got a hold of it along the wall. And we are still tied after an excellent kill by the shorthanded unit. Oh, I really like the penalty kill there. They were on the same page almost all over the ice that entire power play. The game stays tied because of their fine work. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. That pass goes a little sideways. Right out front. Can't get it to click. Puck scooped up by Ovechkin. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. It's all tied up. Nice job tying up his opponent. Quick shot. Oh, -ho! great glove save. Where'd that come from? Can't find his man. And now he moves it to Lafleur. Slides it across. Gives him nothing in front. Yeah, he's a sharp. Scores! And he puts his team in front! James, this game looks really comfortable as a tie game. Now they're ahead. They've got to continue to push. San Jose's had the puck on their stick all night long. Now they finally have a lead in the third. Yeah, but there's still a lot of time left. And they know it. The coaches are talking to them about not taking a step back. The Canucks take it along the wall. That goes off a twig. Dishes it to Tatar. 
Can't catch up to the pass. There's the whistle icing the call. The Canucks still trail in this third period despite numerous scoring opportunities. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. Into the attacking end. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Quick feed to Marshawn. Right in front. And that's picked off. Pumps it away to stay on the attack. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Backhander stopped by the goaltender. Nice pass. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Along the half wall with the puck. Here's a blast. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Moves it to line A. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. San Jose's got the puck along the wall. And we've got a two on one. He scores! On the one-timer, two sweep. He's able to work his way into the low slot to take that pass. He doesn't stop it, so the goalie can't catch up to it. The setters will glide into the dot. Eichel's won the draw here in the neutral zone. Into the attacking area from the left side. Oh, great play to stay on the attack. Well, now you can keep going. What a slithery move. Oh, he'll feel that one. And he passes it up ahead to Sergachev. The silver tips get a hold of the puck in the open ice. They've got numbers. Here he is from the slot, and he rings the post. San Jose's banged about three or four shots off the goal post tonight. They've actually kind of lost count, but at least they have the lead. Oh, denies him with the save. I think he got the blocker on it. And a penalty is coming up as the play is whistled dead here. The silver tips have been served up with a two-minute penalty for charging. I don't know what he possibly could be arguing about here after this penalty. Way too long a run up to the hit. He's got no case. The Canucks send their man advantage unit out once more. And a good read to get possession there with the two centermen tangled up. Doesn't really matter, I guess, what's happened before. This power play is at an important time in the game. They need to find a way to punch through. Turn that chance aside. And now that's picked up by the defense. Glove save, and he made it look simple. He's on it, good chance, but he's able to glove that shot. Oh, look at that, here we go, we got a penalty coming up right here. And the parade to the penalty box will continue as play is called for yet another penalty. Tripping the call here. Always makes me crack up since I've retired and how guys argue about penalties that are so obvious. Two minutes is two minutes and off to the box he goes to think about it. Picked up along the boards by Latang. Beautiful 360 with the puck. Right to the middle, denied by the blocker. He's sharp on this one, out on top of the crease aggressively to make the save. San Jose's penalty has expired. They now go to work on the man advantage. Scores! The power.